Good morning from Norfolk, Virginia. I am going to show you what I packed for my husband and I to eat on this four day trip. My husband and I are both flight attendants and so we do a combination of bringing food and then also enjoying wherever we are. So this is what I packed for us on this four day trip. First, I have my heavy cream. I should say that I eat mostly keto, low carbs. So when I pack, I try to follow that the best I can. Um, so this is my heavy cream for my coffee. I use this rabbit flask because it completely comes apart. So it's much easier to clean than a regular flask. Very important when you are carrying dairy products. So that's important. Always have some nuts with us. Macadamia nuts is our favorite. Um, in a little bit, I'm my husband's gonna have this yogurt for breakfast. And I'm going to make myself some deviled eggs. This is how I make deviled eggs. Um, when I am traveling, I just have a couple of my hard boiled eggs and then I put my mayo and mustard in a tiny little Ziploc. And then I cut open my hard boiled eggs and I put the yolks in here and then I kind of mush them around. And then I cut off the end here and then pipe it like you would put frosting on a cake. And it works out super well, um, super easy. I also brought, I guess for like our main meals, I made two of these. It is, I just threw frozen meatballs, some Rosa Alfredo sauce and some cheese and then vacuum sealed it. And we put them in these like collapsical silicone containers and then heat that up in either our hot logic or our Sabbath heat or put it in the ovens on the plane. Um, so to go along with this, I also have some cream spinach that I added some extra cheese and some bacon bits with. Um, so what's in here is just some like salami and cheese. Charcuterie is such an easy thing to eat when we're on the road since it doesn't have to be heated up. So to go along with that, I'll put some on a plate with the nuts. I also got a couple of these types of pickles and a little bag of olives. So that's what we brought for this trip. Um, gonna go for happy hour later today and enjoy some delicious seafood in Norfolk but that's kind of what we brought to get us by on this four-day trip bye